Hello students, let's do the next problem. So let's read it. It says, Mark places three numbers on the number line. Which of the following number lines represents the correct order? Let's see what we need to do here. So there are three numbers, right? And I wanna find what? I wanna find the correct order, okay? So that's like a number line, right? So it's awesome that we've been doing number lines because then this can help us already to apply what we learned earlier. So the first thing we gotta do is, of course, we're gonna rewrite each one of those numbers. So I'm gonna check on letter A and letter A has square root of 25 over two, which means square root of 25 divided by two. Is that right? No, that is equals to 2.5. Next number in my number line, it's 11 over two, which means 11 divided by two. And that gives me a 5.5. .5. And the last number in letter A number line, is 16 over square root of 16 or 16 divided by the square root of 16 right so if you remember no calculator involved the square root of 16 is 4 just a quick mental math and 16 divided by 4 gives me a 4 now since i'm going to be thinking about money then four dollars will be something like four point zero that's one of the tr uh, troubles that we have sometimes right okay so if you look at letter b and letter c and d they all have the same numbers they're just in different orders right so i don't need to be doing all of each one of those b c and d so i'm gonna go back to my numbers here on 2.5 5.5 and 4.0 since i want them in correct order i gotta think about it could be either from least to greatest or greatest to list. Is that right? It wouldn't matter. But I got to think about an order. So if I look at money, think about money. I'm going to put over here, money. Which would be the smallest amount of money from those two numbers or three numbers? 2.5, 5.5, or 4? 2.5 is like $2.50, right? Yes, that's the smallest one. Okay, who will be next? $4. Awesome. And the last one will be $5.50. So, remember, where this is my smallest numbers, right? And three will be my biggest number. Very good. So, let's look at the number line. In the number line, my smallest numbers are always to the left, right? So this will be smallest number and this will be my biggest or largest number, right? And we'll put the little symbol for number. Give me another word for smallest, right? Smallest will be the one more to the left, right? Very good, okay? So right now I'm looking at the numbers that are more to the left, right? So, my smallest number here is 2.5. So, 2.5, let me look at the number line. It belongs to square root of 25 over 2. So, I do have that one here on letter A, and I have it on letter B. Is that correct? What's the next number that I'm looking for? 16 over square root of 16, which is right on letter B. And of course, the last one would be 11 over 2. Therefore, my answer, yes, it is letter B.